please gather round beside me. I'll give a little class and I'll share a little story of the elephant and the hourglass. Please gather round beside me. I'll give a little class and share a little story of the elephant and the hourglass. One stature is imposing. It's heavy, slow, and strong. The other keeps the meter gently ticking all along. One seems almost immovable, impossible to face. The other passes quietly at a sure and steady pace. One plainly stands before us. We feign at unaware, but to pretend is foolish folly. We both know that it's there. Ah, but ignorance is easier than artificial bliss. Better that than to acknowledge anything could be amiss. So out of sight and mind, the elephant's at play. It grows and gains momentum while we hope it goes away, but by times it just gets bigger. The harbinger of doom. And it's tougher to ignore the elephant that's in the room. Meanwhile, the sand slips silently as time is wont to do. The unforgiving hourglass, it will not wait for you. Each moment as it passes leaves us never to return. And the elephant awaits, like a lesson yet unlearned. Then for some, a sign appears, reminding of reality. A little closer the horizon of our own mortality. And so summoned into action, we examine life's design, and a hard look in the mirror tells us everything's not fine. So much hope and expectation of a memory's replay, or the wish of duplication of what others have to say. But another's path is theirs to walk, and purpose theirs to know. It's likely that we follow those who don't know where to go. The task is yet awaiting finds there's no place left to hide. The path around the elephant is yours now to decide. Sometimes the choice is forced upon an unsuspecting heart, a devastated soul that does not know where to start. How does one rise from the ashes while anticipating gloom and all resulting wreckage from elephants in the room? For the tasks left unattended have now magnified their scale. It's a total renovation that awaits behind the veil. But the time ticks cruelly onward, unperturbed, the hourglass. It cares not if you start or let another moment pass. Yet again, it's up to you as we all reap what we sow. You may gently face the elephant or blindly let it grow. Let's suppose you choose the former and then wonder what to do. In our culture, there are ready-made solutions there for you. But beware and be reminded, this is your life to decide. There's no quick and easy place to put your elephants to hide. Take the path of most resistance and the lesser traveled road. For a time, you'll feel your life has turned from prince into a toad. But the things that serve us best and the choices that are wise are to know what looks like weakness is real strength, but in disguise. To forgive ourselves and others, the most powerful delight that you will never know, always having to be right. The elephant exists as you allowed for it to be, and so it is to be met with respect and empathy. But be warned, the elephant may not see this the same as you. But the hourglass is running. There is just one thing to do. Life is short, or so they say, but it's long enough to know. If the hourglass has sand, then there remains the time to grow. Time is relative. It works with you when optioned honestly. But time denying truth vanishes almost instantly. So take your time. There is no need to rush or zip or zoom. The healing starts with naming the elephants in the room. And if you'd like a little help with a supportive vibe, I know a special place, and it's called the Turtle Tribe. It's where healing hearts empower, and they all collaborate to celebrate each other, encourage, and create. The welcome mats extended. The light is always on. It's a tribe that has a knack 
for turning darkness into dawn. So visit if you wish to, and stay there if you choose, for when you live authentically, you've not a thing to lose. Either way, just please remember, as we dismiss this class, you cannot escape either the elephant or hourglass. If you like this video, please subscribe so you can get notified of future videos like this. And if you'd like some help with naming your elephant, and moving it out of the room and out of your life, join me at theturtletribe.com for daily coaching and tips, encouragement, empowerment, and creative collaboration. Thanks for watching.